Hello, and welcome back to The Way. Not quite where we left off, but I think it's saved, so I should still have the memory, I think. I guess we'll see. But I actually wasn't even intending to bring you back here. I had a lot of questions after editing the last episode that I wanted answered, so I loaded the previous save, the one before last episode, and played through that part on my own and tried out a bunch of different things. Such as, well, first of all, I did not get that weird audio bug that happened last time. After I went through the Stargate, there was some weird sound that kept looping. I thought it was like water, but I actually think it might have been birds. Like the birds flying away and flapping their wings, and that sound effect just looped for some reason. I don't know, maybe because I like went back through the gate and then back again before moving on? No clue, but that didn't happen when I replayed it, so something was weird about that. I tried jumping down to that ladder we saw, where I was like, oh man, I wonder if I can jump down there and catch onto the ladder and skip this part. That ladder is not climbable, it's just scenery, it's like the ladders we see right here, you just, you can't climb them. So, that didn't work, unfortunately. And side note, that section, the one, uh, if we go out here, the one up here, Fuck this section, oh my god, this section I would actually go so far as to say it's pretty poorly designed. Because this section is just anti-fun. I actually, I had some trouble with it last episode, but I got through it fairly easily and didn't really mind it too much. I thought it was like, fine, but playing through it again, it really is just a lot of waiting and a lot of RNG with these fucking lizards. and. Oh man, does it get boring, and then you miss a jump by a pixel, and then you start all the way over again, and you just have to wait for lizards, and... It's not fun. I really don't like it. Oh man, I wish they were more consistent, these, uh, lizards, or... I don't even know what they could do about that, but I do not like that section. And yeah, here's the ladder that I wanted to try and get to, but you can't. If I just try and, like, jump off here, I don't even think you can jump off. Nope, you can't. Uh, I also wanted to try... Oh, we don't even have our little friend. I guess, is he in here? Yeah, he, he just stays here. Okay, so he's gonna just keep following onward instead of backwards. Unless he's, like, way over here, but I doubt it. Let's just check. I checked if you could go up into this, uh, tunnel again. You can't. Nope, he's not here. Okay. Wait, you can't go into this one, right? Hold on. Also, I learned... I discovered, like, a weird... almost frame-perfect trick or something, where I was... I was trying to cheap out the section up here by jumping past, like... Picture one of those uh, grappling dudes right here, the, like, Hydra things or whatever. They're not even Hydras. I'm thinking Hydras from Ragnarok Online, because that's what they look like. Uh, what would you even call those? I have no idea. But the things that grab you. And I cheaped it out by jumping like that and, like, catching on to the ledge. And I have no idea how I did it. I did it one time after, like, two attempts. And then I tried doing it again like 50 times, and I could not do it, so I have no idea. I just happened to discover some, like, frame-perfect thing where you, like, turn at the exact time to catch onto the ledge. I don't even know. I did it in some magical way, so that, that was cool, I guess. And, yeah, we can't go in here. Nope. And we can't go in here. I, I'll show you why not. And the thing I was actually kind of hopeful about was going... Oh. All the way over here, and just going into this temple again, where we electrocuted the, the mama beast thing. I didn't check this, and I was really hopeful, but no, you can't. Because I was really... I wanted to, like, take the little guy all the way through, and then just point at his dead mom and say, You're next, kid, or something, but you can't do that. And let me check my notes. Oh yeah, and last thing, I did try to get eaten by the mom when she, like, reaches down her claw in one of those uh, little tiny holes, you can. I just managed to not get eaten a single time. 
but you can, it's exactly what I said, when you're not there it looks like she can't reach at all, but when you're underneath, she magically reaches down like even further and grabs you. I kind of dislike that because it doesn't really convey it very well, but it wasn't very hard to avoid so I guess that's fine. Alright, anyway, now let's get back to it, let's see what this final temple is all about. I mean, I don't even know if it's final, but it might be final. He did say he thinks the end is near, or like the answer is near. And yeah, we got the, the memory, so let's go! Oh, here we go. Symbol of Eternity. We can drop down here. We can activate that big alien console. And that is all we can do right now. Just one thing, okay. Yeah, and if I just try to use it, nothing. But if I click with my new amazing orb thing, that's kind of weird and not really very helpful. Like, I can't do it from here. No, no, no. You have to be this close, so it's kind of a weird one. But let's see. Completed. Get more data on eternal life. Oh! There was that guy again. Did he take another picture of me? I didn't even notice this time. How did I get the computers? Did I lug them over from the, the ship? And one of the villagers is just really uh, interested. And I'm feeding and taking care of the dog thing. Oh, I brought my wife as well. Where was the dog here? Translation program completed and ready. Translating eternal life. To receive the gift of eternal life, you need to find the pyramid of eternity in the hidden city. But first, you have to prove your worth. Map to the hidden city is written into three crystals. Oh god, it's Ocarina of Time all over again. Get them by doing three trials. Look for the following symbols. Okay, they're the ones I've seen. And trace them with your orb. Put the gathered crystals into the column in this chamber to get further instructions. Okay, that doesn't sound too bad. But maybe there's some, uh, yeah, like some trial for each one. You don't just trace the symbols with your orb. It's you trace them and then you have to probably do some trial to get the, uh, the crystal. Maybe. I don't know. We'll see. How do I escape? X. Collect three crystals from the hidden temples. Collect the mind barrier crystal. Collect the mind force crystal. Collect the triforce of courage mind travel crystal. Yep. It's, it's basically Zelda at this point. Basic dictionary. Alphabet. Grammar rules. Translation system design. Translation system rules. So beautiful. She's like been dead for however long. Oh man. Crystal's pedestal. I need to find the crystals and bring them here. Alien software anatomy. Big alien console. And we just get that again. Yep. All right, where's my dog? Maybe he decided to stay here with the villagers instead of me. He got bored because I never paid attention to him. Oh, whoops. Gobar Ra. What does that mean, though? Bow to you, too. All right. Tin Can and I adored by locals. Why is he called Tin Can? Like that's that's this guy, the dog. I named him Tin Can. Why? But where is Tin Can? Is he here? Oh my god. Hi Tin Can, good boy. He grew up fast. Holy shit. Okay, can we, like, ride him? Nope. Oh, man. 
Alright, this is interesting. I guess he's our method of killing enemies at this point, maybe? Like, you have to avoid them and guide enemies to Tin Can so he can kill them? I don't know, that could be kind of cool, now that we don't have a gun. Alright, so the first one is right here. Let's find out what this one is. Wait, before I do this, I just want to check if they, like, made a bridge over here. Also, hold on. What happens if I climb up here? Is Tin Can gonna follow me? Surely not. No, Tin Can can't follow up here. Okay. Another thing I want to see, what if I kill myself, will Tin Can eat my corpse? Because that's another thing I noticed the, uh, the previous beast, pre Tin Can uh, Alpha or whatever, she would just eat you. Even if you died from a fall, she would go over to your body and just start eating it. Oh, he's sad. Oh, okay. Well, that's something, at least. Oh, they boarded this up. Ah, oh, so we can't go in there again, which is weird because we couldn't go in there anyway already. And yeah, a bridge here now. All right, let's do the first trial. I actually, I feel like everyone probably does that order. Let's be a little bit of a special. It's nice that they have made this bridge for me. Let's be a bit of a special flower and, uh, go do another one. Holy book. God figure. Holy book. Let's just do them in, like, a weird order. Just for the fun of- oh! Oh, I can't do them in a weird order, because I probably need to do the first trial in order to, uh, Get the, uh, oh, do you want to help me? Oh, no, never mind. To get the pistol back, I was gonna say. Hey, Tin Can. Oh, nice. Good job, Tin Can. Okay, so that's how things are gonna work now. What about the plant things that, like, try to eat me? Will he scare those as well? Whoops. Is he gonna mourn now? No? No? Is this something? No. Kind of looks like a suspicious little cavity. Yeah, no sound here. What is it, boy? Kill them all! Yeah, he just scares them all down into the ground. And once again, here... What did you find, Tin Can? Oh, and those just, like, fly away. I see. Here's a symbol. Fuck it, let's do it reverse order. And he's back here with me. Oh, this is new. I can't go down to the old research station anymore. Yeah, I guess let's go check in with DNA, maybe. Oh, is he gonna poke me? Ah, that's what those are here for. Yeah, that's why I thought I could, like, drop down here. But no, they're specifically tin can platforms. Eternal life symbol. Alright, tin can. Come on. Go get him, tiger! Nice! Okay, you can't even die, even if you do run into them. Interesting. Oh, sure. Fuck this guy up. Why not? Good boy. 
Oh, fuck! Okay, never mind, you can die. If you run too far ahead of Tin Can, it's not a good time. He's quite slow. It's basically an escort mission at this point. Oh, what's that? Probably nothing. Yeah, I don't think I can get down there. Alright, so let's not run too far ahead. And let's try and kill all of the things. Wait for me, Tin Can! Just to see if that makes any difference. No, fuck you! Come on, that's bullshit! Oh, for fuck's sake! I waited for him, but you still have to wait even more! Alright. Can you please jump up? Please? Please, Tin Can? How do I get past this point? This is fucking impossible! There we go! Jesus Christ! That's kinda shitty. Yeah, that is a really annoying... One single step. That is just like, oh, what is it? That thing? What? It was already dead. Yeah, like, you have to not climb up all the way, because you need him to get up before you. This is a bit weird to me. I like it in theory, but I feel like he should be closer to you and, like, faster, and following more accurately for that to be not annoying. Our old team. Yeah. DNA? Nope. No DNA. Alright, finally. Let's do one of the trials. I've been taking my sweet time. Oh, and that thing is gone. Maybe permanently, or maybe just like until I die again. Alright, symbol. I didn't even use this thing. Didn't it say I needed to do that? Oh well. Let's see. Mind travel will enable you to be at the right place at the right time. Okay. If you choose your place wrong, you will perish. Like a teleport thing? Teleporting into walls? Sphere upgrade. Oh, I see. If you choose your time wrong, you will perish. Huh. Alright. This sounds interesting. New power. Hold right click to change the sphere's mode. Do it faster! Unlock teleportation mode. Yep. I see. Okay, so this is not like the weapon selection. It's only powers for the, uh, the sphere. Will we never get a gun again? That would be weird. Huh. And yeah, I guess this is like a power gauge. Like, this one doesn't have a power gauge, or it doesn't really get affected by it. But this one will, so... Okay. So it's just like a you place a point to teleport to, and then you teleport back to it. You can't do it in the air. You have to stand still. Or, well, you can move, but you have to touch the ground. If you choose your time wrong, you will perish. So I do this? And then wait here? Or like... I, I mean, I'll just try. Okay, I won't even die here. I thought I would get sapped by a laser. But yeah, I do that. And then switch it off. And then teleport. Goodbye, Tin Can. Take care, I'll be back. Yeah, here we go. Uh, let's just check. 
Okay, nothing. Oh, now I don't even have the power anymore. At least selecting the powers is easy. You don't even need to click or anything. You just mouse over which power you want. Oh, I see. Wait, hold on. Oh. Apparate. Did you just apparate to the same spot? I did. It was an accident. Um. Okay. So there's gonna be some, like, shifting of uh, paths and stuff to make it go a different way, maybe? Switch. Yeah? So that goes up there. I mean, can I just... Okay, hold on. Call it back. Can I set a teleport point on a moving platform? And then we hit the switch. Uh, let's go here. And that teleport point also moves. Oh, no, it doesn't. It gets removed. Or was it because I, uh... I unequipped it? Wait, so if you place one and then unequip it... Oh, it disappears. Okay, hold on. Let me, uh, try this again. So, teleport point there, and now we just switch. Yeah, then it moves. Okay. So, I guess I was just doing it wrong. Yeah, there we go. Alright, never mind. I just did something dumb. And, ladder. And... Has it saved? I think it saved. Yep, fried. Yeah, good. Wonder if there's like an achievement for dying in every possible way. Um, this looks very suspicious. Aha! Alright, I get it. So all you do here is hit the switch. Run quite a distance. Over here, place one. And then run all the way back. Hit the switch again. Teleport to it. That should be fine. I probably could have just jumped right there, but let's do it one more time. There we go. Yeah, cool. I can climb down again. Cube! Okay. Panel. Can I access that? Yeah, I can, but I need to be close to it. And I can't do this in midair. Aha! Okay. So, once again, we do teleportation. Oh, I see! Um... Oh, this one is a bit tricky. If I place it here, nothing. Because I need to get onto the platform. Can I jump up before it gets here? Ah, oh, fuck. Well, if I don't fuck up, maybe. Oh, no, you can't! The, uh, the ladder gets taken away if it's right here. Okay, so that's not how you do it. How do I... Oh, no, I, I get it, yeah. You just have to climb up first. So just place it there. Now we move over here. Teleport back. 
Drop down. Teleport again. Move this over here. Yeah, now the, the puzzle elements of this game are really starting to appear. And then we use the Axis one. Ah! I didn't even realize we couldn't go up there before now. This is still not open, though. Wait, did I... This didn't start out right there. I'm just gonna move it right there and see if it opens. I don't think it does. Oh, I can't move it anymore. Oh, okay. Never mind. This is done. And another autosave. So, teleport and then I drop down and it's gonna start crushing me. Yep. And I teleport away. And then we run across. Yep. But I didn't die from it. I guess I'll die from it. Dead. Oh my god. Okay, that one was even worse than the elevator. Or maybe it was the same animation, I'm not sure. There we go. Panel. Axis. Aha. Ah, okay. Challenge complete, I see. So now we have to do two more in this trial. Alright, cool. I, I guess I'll do that next time. Let's leave it here for now. Hope you enjoyed, thanks for watching, and I'll see you then. Bye-bye!